Hello everyone, welcome back to another video for gaming. And today we are back on Mineplex as you can see and we are gonna play some mini games. And the mini game for today if the lag gonna kind of like go down. The mini game for today, what it gonna be? What it gonna be? Stop lagging so much. We gonna do block hunt. If you don't know what block hunt is, block hunt is a game. Wow, it's a lag. Block hunt is a game that you, they basically hide us and seek us. That's basically like hiding seek. Just you can choose from to be every single block. You have weapons and that's it. You must, it's a hide there. You must, you must uh, be until the end of the game. Live and then you win as a sickle you must kill every single not you must but your team must kill every single hider before the time runs out and the game is kind of like five six minutes I think and that is basically the game hide of sick just block hound because in Minecraft it you hunt block not people so not hide and seek you hunt block and with this thing right here the click bomb to change form this actually what I told you to change form with and the best to be is actually a flower pot and go on one of the roofs because then you can shoot hunters and you can upgrade your hacks every time you shoot in a, in a, a, every couple of time you shoot in a, in a, basically in a seeker you get you actually have a chance to upgrade your axe, and after three times you upgrade in the third form. And after you know, when we get our bow, you will see shoot hunter to upgrade. When I shoot the hunter, it should, you know, after three times, I think it should. And you also have this if you meow, you get 0.25 gems. If you shoot a firework, you get um, two gems. So if you do stuff that you say where is the location is so we get gems for it. It's pretty crazy but true. So here I'm thinking it's kind of like the base the best place because you can see everything from it. And I just try to shoot this hunter right here. This one is the TNT one which you can shoot and we hit him one, we hit him two, three, and we do not have enough time to upgrade our axe. Uh, you just be here I don't know, it just look more normal. Just shoot. Him, and you can be even animals, so crazy is this, right? And we upgrade our axe to, from wood to stone, and you can upgrade all the way to diamond. And all, and when you right click the axe, you get a, a speed boost. And every time the, uh, the, the, sorry, the axe upgrade is go up, the amount of, the amount of speed you get also go up with the upgrade. So it's really, really cool. And actually, why it's best to be the flower pot here is because it's really hard to spot them on the office. You're just really small and really hard to eat as well. So we're gonna try this one. Have a compass which you can find. I actually never play a game with him, but after we shoot a couple of hunters, it's really don't never mind because we just one and everyone can spot a running flower pot. I think. Although if you're blind, so we can't, right? I suggest we play. Alright, let's shoot some hunters. And they also can know where it comes from because it can come for literally every block. It can be every single block in this in this game. So it's kind of like more tough. And we upgrade to Iron Axe, which is better than of course on. And I want you to upgrade the axe to maximum to show you. And we get a Hyper Axe, which is Diamond. We get a maximum. And they find out time here. So. I'm just gonna need to kind of like be here and no one would take care of us. And I don't think it's gonna happen really. Because they know we are here. Let's just shoot a couple of them. You don't have to shoot them after you upgrade your axe to the maximum, but you just kind of like help your team because you can help them. And you have two and two, two, two three minutes, I thought. Three minutes until the game end, and we're gonna need to take down this guy with the compass because he can see where to go. This is bad because he can see us. Although everyone kind of knows because we shoot like 10,000 hunters, and uh, 
T is the, the one with T and T. Actually, it's a when co come back to his after a few times, and we almost fell out of the wolf, which is gonna, probably gonna be our death. So, what you gonna do now? Kind of like one, get into one of the houses and just just hide a bit. And they cannot know because it's small and pretty easy to not get spotted. Only the guy with the TNT has the most chance to find you. And I hope I don't gonna kill in one point I'm gonna get killed in on purpose because I want to show how it is to beat in hunter. It's gonna be pretty soon because you just use this and you get some gems and if they kill us we know we came with this because I want to show you what you do when you're hunter. I just do some meow here, shoot some hunters, why not? And also what I want to show you is actually the boost that you can get. See it's boost like five speed. It's amazing speed. Amazing speed. And we're just gonna run until someone's gonna kill us. We want to be dead. And you can attack with the hyper axe as well. When I'm just running to get the last firework to get some free gems, because everyone likes free gems on Minecraft. I mean, who don't like? Probably my friend, which is the worst at Mineplex. I mean, he's so bad. I don't know how he's the bad at every, everyone. And we're gonna die. And we got come killing him. And kill. And I'm stuck. <laughs> I die from suffocating in the wall. So I'm actually gonna buy, I'm not gonna buy it. I'll show you next video because it's gonna be another part. And now we just have to jump and stick from hide the box and can be anywhere, they even can be on our ship. Push. But the hunter is really really hard to kind of found because you can be literally every single thing in, in Minecraft you can be in this game and find it, it's really pretty really hard. Plus, they have so many weapons, that is unbelievable. Play Iron Stick on, on the Hive, and they just have a wooden sword with knockback. That's it. And we also have a bow, but it's not armed with our, our uh, axe, which is actually an iron one. So we start with an iron, and here when the campus guy comes in handy, because in this game, in the normal Hide and Seek, you can know what blocks can be. In this Hide and Seek, you can be literally every single thing and the hide just want the game and it's really really tough and that's gonna be a one video for today actually I, I do also my Windows 10 edition beta if you don't see it go check it we go to the nether we die horribly for me just watching into the lava like a perfect idiot but before our time run out we must do something important open a treasure chest of course open by Come on, the put chest with the plate open. Oh, all oh, chests, choose all oh, chests to open. Hope for pet. We want some pets. I only have three for all the Minecraft pets and I want as much as possible. 34 melons. Whoa, there's a lot of fireworks. Paintball, I have more than 1000 paintball gun ammo. And pearls. Not pet, not pet. But we're gonna get it. We're gonna get it at some point. I mean, in every, in almost every day, I'm gonna do a video about Minecraft, and every day, I'm gonna open a treasure chest. And the next video, we might open even a mythical chest or an ancient chest. So we probably gonna get some pretty decent stuff. You know what would be funny if I open a, a mythical chest, and why in the first one, I'm gonna upgrade to a titan? It's gonna be amazing. But anyway, guys. That was our video for today. If you, if you ask my why my skin is different, if you don't see the last video, go check it out. But it is I changed my skin to Halloween kind of like thingy, as you can see. Well, I think like curved pumpkins and like that. But yeah, guys, that's basically was block hunt. You see everything you can be in the game. Hope you enjoyed this video. Hope you like, subscribe for daily gaming and Minecraft videos. Bye bye my friends.